Good afternoon, everybody. This is Damon Bond of Bond Realty Group, licensed real estate broker in the states of Connecticut and New York. Hope everybody is doing well um, this day. Happy New Year's to everybody out there. Um, hope your last year was prosperous. And if not, I hope 2018 uh, will be more prosperous or prosperous, I should say. Um, if you have any questions, uh, you can always email me at dbond011 at gmail.com. That is dbond, D-B-O-N-D, 011 at gmail.com. Or you give me a call, 203-394-8123. You give me a call or text, 203-394-8123. Um, I, if you do text me, uh, if you do leave me a message, I will get back to you as soon as I can. Um, so hope everybody is doing well. Today, it is cold up here in the tri-state area. Uh, today, I think, is actually a balmy 23 degrees. So if you happen to be out of town or anything like that, I have a couple of clients who are out of town. So stay where you are as long as you can because it is cold up here. Um, so anyway, um, 2018, I just want to talk about uh, things you could do uh, to get yourself working um uh, for 2018, it was interesting because uh, yesterday, on New, or New Year's Day, I was looking at some uh, expired listings on the various MLS that I'm a member of, and I saw some of these uh, things, you know, they were uh, you know, uh, uh, a year in the market, in some cases two years in the market, I saw one three year in the market, and I'm looking at them, I'm like, wow, uh, why have you sit so long? I mean, the property seems nice, there's nothing, you know, out of character with them, they're all in so-called great locations. Um, the house is, you know, nice. I would say, is the price too high? Or oh, not? I couldn't understand why none of these uh, uh, homes have sold. So it got me thinking, um, just dealing with the seller side, is this. If you are looking to put your house in the market, uh, don't wait till spring. Do it now. Uh, yeah, as freezing cold as it is right now, uh, it was like five degrees or seven degrees, you know, yesterday morning or some crazy numbers. It's, it's, it's freaking cold out here, uh, ladies and gentlemen. But if you are looking to put your home on a market, do it now. Don't use that old tired cliche about I'm going to wait until springtime. And the reason why is because everybody wakes in the springtime. And when your houses are out there, you know, there's a lot of houses out there. The market is going to be inundated with a lot of properties for sale. You may say, well, you know, I'll give buyers more choice. Yeah, they'll give buyers more choice, but at the same time, buyers can be more picky of what they can choose. So your house may be, you know, nice and everything like that, but the guy's house down the street may be nicer for a better price or it may be nicer for a little bit more price, but they don't mind paying a little bit more money for the house because it has everything they want. So put it on now because I got two deals going on right now and we're going to close this month in January. Right, and I had a uh, I closed in the house in December, so all these have been very cold temperature, you know, days, if you will. And and the reason why that is because the more the s most serious buyers, you, you know, if they're if they're gonna dredge out in ice and 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 snow and like freezing temperatures, right? They're looking to purchase a house. All right, so if you're in a position to put your house in the market, if your house is all ready, right? To present and everything like that, you don't have to worry about you know moving the kids out of the you know school or whatnot. That's not an issue. Man, put your house in the market uh, because there will be buyers who are searching for that. Don't wait till the spring because typically if you wait till the springtime, and I'm saying if you have to wait till the spring, that's one thing you know because of the kids and school and anything, everything like that and work. I get it, but typically you know if you wait till the spring, springtime comes. You know, first signs of warm weather, open houses come, people looking in. Eh, it's nice. It's nice. Not necessarily serious buyers. You don't want to be in that category. All right. So because the thing is this, the spring comes, then the summer, people go away. You know, um, rarely do people find the house they want after the first showing. You know, usually it'll take several, many showings for them before they find the perfect property. Very few people like that. So springtime comes, summertime, you know, passes by. People want to take a break because they've been, they looked at like 50, 50 houses already, you know. They got to go away on vacation. Uh, they come back. It's September. It's back to school. You know, whatever it is, vacation's over. And they say, okay, I'm going to put it back on the back burner, right? That's what sometimes can happen. So if you want to put your house in the market, 
do it now. There's no reason to wait unless you absolutely have to wait. Uh, that's my recommendation to you. Um, we have a bunch of agents here. Uh, so if you are selling your house in the tri-state area, or I should say in the dual state area, New York and Connecticut, uh, we do have agents over here who can assist you with that. So, you know, this is something to consider. Put your house out there in the market, um, you know, as soon as you can. And, uh, you know, hopefully somebody will buy. And also make sure that the house is listed appropriately. We're going to talk about that in another video clip, but I just want to give that message to you now. So I hope this was useful. I hope it was handy. Um, if you have any questions, you can always in, email me once again at dbond011 at gmail.com. That's dbond011 at gmail.com. You can always give me a call, 203-394-8123. I hope you have a very wonderful new year, prosperous new year. Um, and be well, be safe. And be warm, okay? Good day.